Well, Jason, not the best kept secret in football, this one. Um, it's been a long time coming, hasn't it? Yeah, I think, um, you know, uh, Leeds showed an interest um, a, a few weeks back or a month or so ago, and as soon as they were interested, it was um, a move I wanted, and I wanted to get it done, and I'm just glad to get it done now. How important was it for you to get your future sorted quickly as well? Because obviously it's going to be a big summer here, but also a big summer for everyone at Portsmouth. Yeah, I mean, obviously it's been difficult at Portsmouth. Uh, I think everyone knows what's going on there and um, it is difficult. But, you know, it's, um, hopefully the club does get sorted out um, for the good and, and they can move on. Uh, but for me personally, and obviously coming here to a massive club, um, obviously with the gaffer, um, it's, it's going to be great and, and I know he's obviously he wants to bring in a lot of new players so it's going to be hopefully a real good place to be. What's Neil Warnock been saying to you then when he's been talking you into coming up here? Uh, no, he just sort of showed me around the training ground and the ground as soon as I'd seen, seen that I knew it was a massive club and it's, it's great facilities and one that I, couldn't, I just couldn't turn down really so no, I'm, I'm delighted to uh, be here now and I can't wait to move forward. What have you made to the, the news over the last week or so there's going to be a big turnaround here, 11 players being put on the, on the transfer list are told that they can leave the football club, what have you made to that whole situation? Uh, you know, I just, at the end of the day, that's up, that's up to the gaffer um, to choose. You know, it's, it's hard um, seeing like, players leave, you know, but um, hopefully we'll get a new crop here, some good lads, and um, we can have a real good go next year. How important is it for you as well to be coming to a club like Leeds that can be pushing for a place in the Premier League if, if everything goes right this summer? Yeah, no, obviously it's, um, it's a massive club, so I think um, the fans here, they, they want to be back where they belong, really. and. Hopefully, um, I can I can help towards that. You know, I, I got I got the drive. I I'll always give 100%, and, and that's all, all I do. But no, the gaffer wants to bring in some good players, so I'm looking forward to being a part of it. Had it been a, a difficult last year for you? You got Player of the Year for parts with obviously though with the, the points deduction relegation. Yeah, I mean it's, it has been a difficult year. Um, when I was at Bournemouth, we went through administration, but it was a little bit different at Portsmouth. Um, it was a lot more difficult losing players, and no, I mean it was it was hard. But you know, I was captain. I had to try and keep the, the players together and, and keep us going till the end. And we, in the end, we we come so close, um, but just just didn't make it in the end. But no, it was it was tough, uh, but it was a good learning curve for, for the players. Is that an important role for you here as well? Do you feel obviously coming in as a, the first one, there's going to be a lot of new faces in. Do you think you'll be able to help everyone? Bed in, I suppose. I don't know. I think everyone's going to be in the same position, obviously, all the new lads. Um, but no, hopefully, we can all, all get a good bond quickly um, in pre season and uh, we can have a, have a good pre season and, and start the season well. What sort of a player are you then? What sort of a centre half are you? Um, I think not, everyone knows I'm obviously a no nonsense centre half. I put my head in where a lot of players don't put my head in. I would always give 100%. And, uh, I'm, I'm a team player and, and, and hopefully, I'm a leader as well. So no, I can't, I can't wait. Excited now? Yeah, yeah, can't wait. Delighted to get it done.